right. State your first and last name. Ronald Edwin. All right. And today's date? September 17th. Do I have your permission to record you? Yes. Awesome. All right. Do I have your permission to conduct this experiment? Yes. All right. Ready for it? Sure. All right. <clears throat> this is a very serious talk we're about to have. Okay. 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 Um, so I want you to know that um, I, I feel it's my duty to tell you, as weird as this might be, um, so I've studied lie detection. Right. And so right now, um, I'm going to ask you a few questions. Okay. And, um, by the way, you're off work. This is work right now. Okay? Okay. So uh, I study lie detection, I study macro and micro expressions. Basically, I can't beat, I can beat a lie detector, but I can't beat macro and micro expressions even I know about them. So the body does involuntary things that they can't help. And you've made several of them already. Okay. If you cannot help, I can't help if you were skilled in that art, I couldn't help it and you'd be able to catch me in a lie, just like that. Instantaneous. Okay. So, <clears throat> so I'm doing this one of two ways, uh, or I'm sorry, I'm doing this in two phases. It's my initial, and then it's so I can review the video, and I have special software that will be able to detect things in your and other stuff. Ready? Okay. All right. So, I'm going to ask you several questions that I know the answer to and I'm going to tell you right now if you answer truthfully to this this is your one and only chance that you will not be terminated okay okay I promise you you will not be terminated because a it has nothing to do with the partner okay I also promise I will not terminate you because you were truthful with me I give everybody one chance if a telemarketer calls me and they tell me their name is Billy Joe Bob and an Indian accent I'm going to say I'm going to give you one more chance to start this relationship on the right foot by telling me your real name. If you continue to lie to me, then why would I trust you to buy a product from me? Fair enough? Fair enough. If I have you in my inner circle, in my house, in my sanctum, I want to know that I can trust you. So I'm going to give you one chance to come to me. And as a respect for you, I'm not going to do lie detection on you again for a hot minute just because I feel people have a right to lie. It's their own privacy. Who am I that I need to know your inner stuff, right? Right. It's your own privacy. So before we continue, do you have keys on you? I do. Can I have them, please? Just the two that one pertains to the store, one pertains to the van. This does not go well. I can keep your right on. I know certain things, and it was within my legal right to have a camera in a rented part of said privacy of hers. Okay. It was legal right for her to place a the camera there. Said privacy of who? Giselle. Giselle. Giselle's, Giselle's the same. Giselle. Okay. She has a legal right to put a, she rents a place, she has a legal right to put a camera in her own place to see who goes in and what they do while she's not there. Okay. So I'm going to ask you some questions. I'm going to ask you to be honest. You have one shot at this. Okay. Okay? Okay. 
I will not be upset the fact that you've lied to me in the past as long as you tell me the truth now. That doesn't mean you can... I'm not going to be upset. I will not be upset if you lie to me in the future, depending on what it is. But it's your right to lie to me, even in the future. I will not be upset. Right. And your career here will not be in jeopardy. Okay. I want to know the truth. Of course. Okay. I want to know. I'm curious now. Okay. Ready? Ready. Okay. So, I have a list of items uh -huh. that were taken before you answer. Okay. I'd like to know what pawn shop. I'm not asking for reimbursement right now or anything like that. Uh -huh. Okay. I'd like to know what pawn shop they are or where they are. If they were burned, that's fine. I'm not gonna let, I'm not gonna make a big deal and she's not gonna make a big deal. Uh -huh. I wanna know where the items are. Okay. I don't care if they're in a pawn shop. I'll pay my own money to get them out. I'm not even gonna make you do that. Okay. Okay. I wanna know where her stuff is. Her stuff? All of it. That didn't take any. Someone did. Of course. Who? Okay. Well, I think you know. Of course, but can we get into details of what stuff so I can get to the bottom of it? <clears throat> I assure you, I did not take any stuff. Okay, I understand, but you do know who did. Okay. Okay. Yes or no? Right now, do you know who took the stuff? Yes. Okay. Now. Are they in a pawn shop? Yes or no? No. Are they burned? No. Are they trashed? No. Are they in your home? Yes. Okay. Which stuff are they? I already have a list. She's OCD, dude. She, gave, All she I has know a list. Is some clothes. Yep. A jacket? I'll check exactly. I don't know. Okay. I don't know if there's an issue. So. And makeup. I did tell her to put it both. Most. I told her to put it all back, but... You didn't tell her to put it all back. No, you're right. I told her to put most of it back. So it wasn't noticeable. Okay. Sorry. At this point, I respect your honesty. Mm -hmm. Because it was caught on camera, and I was going to have you all arrested. So I'd like for you to go get it and bring it all back. And we will speak nothing of this. You will not be in trouble whatsoever. Okay. Okay? Yeah. There's a reason.